Hello, Staten Island. This is Pamela Silvestri at the Staten Island Advance. We're here today at Ang Angaro Pizzeria, and that is a coal-fired pizzeria. Very unusual, actually, in New York City uh, these days, especially with all the uh, building codes and everything. But they do have a coal-fired pizza oven, and it's amazing. It gets very, very hot. The pizza is very distinct, and we're going to take a look at that in just a moment. Uh, in the meantime, I just want to uh, thank the Avenel uh, Performing Arts Center for sponsoring today's episode. Uh, hello, Frank. Good to see you. Uh, and I just want you to shout out where you're tuning in from on Staten Island or beyond. So we do have a lot of listeners uh, and people who tune in uh, from South Carolina, North Carolina, Florida. I would love to know what town you're tuning in from. So this is Pamela Silvestri. We're here at uh, Angaro Pizzeria, and I'm going to just show you the delicious is coming out here. Hold on. Here we go. Yum. Look at that. That is the Sicilian pizza. Um, and so we're here in Port Richmond, and this is on Forest Avenue, actually. And uh, Forest Avenue in Port Richmond, it's diagonally across the street from Stop and Shop. Uh, and so let's see here. We have, it's at 1298 Forest Avenue. And we're going to interview the owners of the pizzeria, which opened in 2020. Uh, and this is the dining room, actually, which is beautiful. It's a tiny little place. Uh, but very sweet. And uh, sometimes I drive past on Forest Avenue and I see it and I see people enjoying themselves in the pizzeria, finally indoor dining, right? Um, so I'm just gonna pan over this while I'm talking to you. And I just wanna thank uh, a Curtains restaurant in the Avenel Performing Arts Center in New Jersey for sponsoring this episode. Um, and also, just so you know, Steve Solomon's My Mother's Italian my Father's Jewish and I'm Home for the Holidays will be playing uh, from November 17th to November 21st. That's right, that's the Avenel Performing Arts Center. So, and uh, greetings to you, Staten Island. Uh, this is Pamela Silvestri uh, at the Staten Island Advance. I'm here at Ungaro's Pizzeria, excellent pizzeria. I mean, beautiful food. Uh, and you're gonna see some wings actually that they're known for. And uh, so hello to you, a big hug to you. Hello, Angie, good to see you. Um, also, shout outs to my cousin, Joanne, uh, who absolutely loves Patrizia's restaurant and Villa Paradiso uh, for birthdays, uh, which is actually a story on SI Live for some of the best places to go on Staten Island for birthdays, uh, Panini Grill and such, putting you know fireworks and things like that in pizzas. Uh, Nuremberger Beer House puts like a disco ball on, so you can see all that in a video on SI Live. Uh, this is Pamela Silvestri. I'm here at Ungaro's, Ungaro's, excuse me, uh, 1298 Forest Avenue. Uh, so show us some love here. And uh, also I want to give a shout out to Anthony DeMeo, uh, who wants to say hello to Camille at the Curly Wolf Saloon, which is new to Annadale. Um, also, uh, Robert uh, Balzarini, hello to you. Rosa from Bayabar, uh, greetings to you. And also, um, happy birthday to Millie Guzzo, Carrie at Lee Sims Chocolates on Manor Road, Dan Shanad, who does a great broadcast, uh, and Peter Francis Battaglia. So, and also, Vandy Alba, who lives in the neighborhood. So, with that, I'm going to show you some of the deliciousness. And Kim uh, Angaro is going to say hello to us. So, hello, Kim. How are you? I'm good, thank you. It's good to see you. And I would love to hear you to tell us a little bit about the pizzas here. So we're looking at what? It's got banana peppers? Uh, no, no, actually, that's not thick crust Sicilian. Okay, nice, looking good. This is the thick crust Sicilian. Now, I understand that you did not make this pizza for some time. Is that because of the weather, or what's the deal with that? Oh, no, originally we weren't. It was, it's a little tricky to make a Sicilian, the thick Sicilian, in a pure coal oven, but. Uh, my husband mastered it, and uh, now we are serving it. And uh, let's take a look at the, the pizza master himself. So uh, give a hello. Hi, how are you? And uh, right here is Dom. And anybody recognize Dom, if you can tell me the pizzeria that they owned uh, in, uh, it was Oakwood, Bay right? Bay Terrace. Uh, if you can tell me the pizzeria that they owned, a uh, little hint here, his name is uh, Dominic. So, uh, <laughs> so, and if there's any place that you remember out on the South Shore, uh, and please say hello. Hello, Peter, good to see you. Thank you so much. And uh, this is what the coal-fired oven looks like. That must be kind of uh, an interesting thing to manage. So why did you go with the coal-fired oven? I just wanted to do something different. Uh-huh. Um, the pizza's cooked in three minutes. Excellent. What, what's the temperature of the oven? 750. 750. Can you yeah. imagine 750 degrees? You've got some fans on here. Hello, Michelle. Uh, Michelle says, hi, Dom. Hello, Bill. Uh, hello, Sylvana. And a big hello to Dr. Sylvia Clark up at Wagner College. Uh, this here is Dom uh, from Ungaro's Pizzeria. So how do you say the last name? Ungaro. Ungaro. That's, <laughs> thank you for correcting me on that You're one. Welcome. And uh, with that, let's just take a look at some of the deliciousness over here. Um, and this is a, must be a meat lover's pie. Yes, that is our meat lover's pie. Excellent. That's new to the menu. Excellent. Tell us what, what kind of meat is on here. Some. That's um, 
That's meatballs, sausage, and ham, and pepperoni. pepperoni. And so you can have your choice of hot sausage or sweet sausage. Yes. Hot or sweet sausage on there. Excellent. Buongiorno. Hello, Kelly. It's good to see you. Kelly says hello. Ciao. And uh, oh my gosh, this looks fantastic. What is this? So Red, white, and green. Our Yum. thin crust Sicilian is very popular. It used to be very popular at Domenico's also. Uh, grandma is marinara and uh, grandpa is vodka. So with this one, we combined four corners. So it's marinara, vodka, bianca, and pesto. Oh my goodness, it smells fantastical. So we've got here, this is a vodka. And then we've got the basil, pesto. Mm -hmm. Is there any nuts in there? Are there any nuts? There is pinon. There are pine nuts in there. And uh, we have the grandma slice. And uh, wow, look at that. That is so beautiful how you do the, uh, the star shape with, their, with the ragotta cheese. Very, very nice. And then we have, uh, this must be truffle on that's, here? That's prosciutto and arugula. Pr prosciutto and arugula. Parmesan very, very nice. Cheese. Excellent. Uh, so Peter says, I'll scrub a toilet for that Sicilian. <laughs> yes, I think we all would. It's, it smells absolutely fantastic. Uh, Carol, hello. Hello, oh, her, hello, Hernandez. Yes, good to see you. And we have here Jorge Delicioso. Yes, indeed. Love Ungaro Coal Fired Pizza Cafe. Thank you, Roseanne. Uh, Roseanne, it's good to have you. Uh, Mario, good to have you. Uh, so let me just uh, share the screen here with Kim. Hello, this is Pamela Silvestri. I'm here with Kim, who is one of the owners of the pizzeria. And uh, why don't you tell us, uh, people are going crazy with pizza uh, slices all over the place. Hi from NYC at the moment. Hello, good to see you. Yes, and we're gonna get a quick pan of what the restaurant looks like here. So it's kind of tiny, uh, very sweet. Uh, there's uh, several tables here. Um, Kim was saying how they had a nice crowd on Saturday night. One of the things that they are actually known for um, has become their wings. Uh, and as you can see, we have an Italian pepper on here. Um, absolutely, what, what is the flavor on this? So this is um, our homemade sweet sauce with caramelized onions that are delicious like candy. They bake in that oven. Caramelized onions and the long hot pepper. Excellent. Hello, Anthony DeMeo. Can't forget anchovies. Absolutely. You do anchovy of pizza? Course, yes, course. they do do anchovies. Excellent. My favorite, actually. So here we go. Uh, Peter, oh my goodness. Yes, indeed. Uh, Angela is sending some love. Thank you very much. It's good to see you. Hello, Mary Spencer. This is the mozzarella tomato and olive salad. Very nice with a little balsamic glaze on there. This it looks delicious. This That's is a salad. salad. This is the Cobb salad. So we've got some avocado on here and uh, grilled chicken. So at Ungaro Pizzeria, which is on Forest Avenue at 1298 Forest Avenue. And we have delicious. Our rice balls, our homemade risotto balls. So the risotto balls, do they have meat in them? So we make them both ways, cheese or meat and cheese. So we have meat or cheese and uh, Look at that. Deirdre, hello. Good to see you. Angela, thank you so much for sending some love. So tell us where you're tuning in from Staten Island. This is your food community. Please, this is where you're going to meet people uh, who have a similar interest in food on Staten Island. If you're, um, let's see here. I got to get those wings. Where are they located? So tell us what the hours are. Okay, so we're 1298 Forest Avenue and we are located um, on the corner of Forest and Hamlin Place and we are close to Jewett, right up diagonal from Stop and Shop. Excellent, so 12. Plus from the Salvation Army. 1298 Forest Avenue, right? Yes. Excellent, so every day you're open at noon? Uh, yes. Noon to what, 10? To 10. Noon to 10 every day, except Monday. Monday except you take Monday. a break. Monday we're closed. So I have to tell you, this piece is absolutely delicious. I live in West Brighton, and a lot of my neighbors actually come down here to Port Richmond to have this deliciousness. They do deliver, uh, it's at 1298, uh, Forest Avenue, diagonally across from the Stop and Shop, actually, in the shopping center where Popeyes is and such. So, and right across the street from the Salvation Army. So this is what the wings look like. What's on here? So, Pam, these are the, the uh, buffalo wings. Excellent. Buffalo wings with blue cheese or with ranch. And we've just recently added three additions to the wing menu. We now have uh, sweet chili wings. Uh, we have hot barbecue, which are very hot. And, and teriyaki. teriyaki. So, so something for everyone. Excellent. Very, very nice. You do a beautiful job here. And I just want to show you the, the detail in some of this. So um, meatballs are very popular. Meatballs are the hottest dish here, yeah. apparently. Uh, it's our homemade recipe in the family for years. Uh, delicious. You'll think that your grandmother made them. So this is the, these are the meatballs at Angaro's Pizzeria. You've got to say the name for me because you say it best. I'm sure you go, though. <laughs> <laughs> Angaro. And, uh, how did you get into the business, by the way? How did I get in? Yeah. I've been in business for a very long time, since I'm 11 years old, working with my uncle. Excellent. And, uh, 
So, so and tell us where the pizzeria was where that you it had. Was in Sheepshead Bay, Brooklyn. Connie's Pizzeria, it's still there. Anybody remember Connie's Pizzeria? Yeah, it's uh, over 60 years old now. Oh, neat. Yeah. And uh, were you born on Staten Island or born in Brooklyn? I was born in Brooklyn. Nice. And what, what part of Italy is your family from? Mola di Bari. Very nice. Small little town. Excellent. So, uh, anybody have any questions here? For Dom and uh, the restaurant that you owned, if you can, if anybody could tell me where it was located in Bay Terrace, uh, I will give you two tickets to uh, Steve Solomon's My Mother's uh, Father, My Mother's J Jewish, uh, my, no, excuse me, My Mother's Italian, My Father's Jewish, and I'm Home for the Holidays, The Therapy Continues, which is at the Avenel Playhouse. So you can get two free tickets if you uh, let me know. So Edward Lugo, nice owners, absolutely. Peter, imagine the kind of volume they can do, absolutely. Uh, well, here, Anthony DeMeo, good luck to you guys. I can't wait to get your pizza. My dad makes meatballs stuffed with raisins. Actually, are they stuffed with raisins? No. No raisins in this one, Anthony. You're going to have to stick with the home one for that. And uh, yes, the wings are unbelievable. So I'm going to actually sample that when we get off the air because there's no gracious way of eating that. Um, and tell me what we have here. So um, we make... Um few different types of panini but that one is a uh, truffle chicken truffle chicken it's a uh, grilled chicken with cranberries avocado red onion with a truffle mayo excellent it looks absolutely beautiful and uh, we have here oh eggplant rollatini very nice and Pam this pie I wanted to show you this one this is um Dominic took this is a uh, burrata all right we'll roast it uh, cherry tomatoes and marinara sauce um, everything's roasted in the, everything here is roasted in the uh, coal oven. So it's a few layers of flavor. A few layers sure. of flavor. Very, very nice. And th this is the, what the coal fired crust looks like. You can see that it, it bubbles, blisters. it blisters. So this is, this is the deliciousness here you can see, right? So coal fired oven gets to a hundred, what, 750 degrees? We cook at 750, but people cook at 800, 650, it depends. Nice. The person, you know, who's running the operation. Excellent. And uh, just a hello from Daisy. Good morning from the city of Jacksonville, Florida. Hello. Good, good to have you. We have a lot of people here who tune in from Florida who want to see what Staten Island pizza looks like these days. So this is a remarkable one. This is a burrata cheese. Uh, we have, uh, this is roasted tomatoes. Roasted tomato, cherry, uh, cherry tomatoes. Roasted cherry tomatoes. With Parmesan cheese sprinkled on top. Very nice. It smells so, so good. Anthony and wings on, oh wow, Sunday eggplant rollatini is one of my favorite. It's been my favorite dish always. And I wanted to show you the detail on these beautiful pies. Um, so, you know, pizza is an art. Uh, this is handled absolutely beautifully. Uh, just take a look at this. This is the Four Corners Pizzeria, uh, pizza, excuse me. And uh, look at the detail on that with the regatta cheese and the roses. So um, anyway, but I want to say hello to you. How are you? Hi. This is Manny. Hello, Manny. How are you doing? Good to see you. Why don't you tell us a little bit about the art of making pizza? Like what time do you, well, do you do the dough? Like a day ahead of time? Does it have to proof? No, the dough has to need to have at least a couple of days. A couple to, of days? So we can use the dough to make the pizza. Otherwise, the crust is not going to be the same. And uh, the taste is different. The dough is not have like certain time, like for couple, two or three days. And, um, yeah, today's dough is from three days ago. Oh, amazing. Yeah. Yes. So, and then let's just take a look at the, the, the crust on here because this is kind of the art of making pizza. Um, basically, it proofs for a few days, and uh, that's why it tastes so delicious. Hello, D. Good to see you. Denise, hello, be safe. You too, Denise. Thanks for always tuning in. Hello to you tuning in from Las Vegas. How about that, Anthony? Uh, good to see you, Denise. I share it, and you are very sweet for doing that. One day I want to treat you to a pizza, Denise, because you've been a terrific, terrific fan here. So let's just take a look at the pizzas again, and then we're going to wrap it up. And we're here on Forest Avenue, 1298 Forest Avenue, and it's in Port Richmond, and we're here at Angaro's Pizzeria. And if you have not tried it, you must, because it really is fantastic. It's probably, I'm going to say, probably one of the top 12 pizzas on Staten Island. But we also have uh, salads. This is the Cobb salad. This is the tomato and mozzarella salad with balsamic glaze. And this here is their one of their signature dishes. Um, tell me again. Classic. This is the classic, uh, classic wings. wings. Excellent. Yes. And sweet caramel onions and uh, hot long pepper. Excellent. Beautiful. You do beautiful work. And this is the other wing dish, actually. This has got the um, hot sauce on it. Yum. That's the buffalo wings. These are buffalo wings. What's the sauce on the side? Is that blue uh, cheese? That's a 
a blue cheese, but also we can uh, have a ranch. Usually people have, like ranch. Nice. And the blue cheese. This is uh, uh, the flatbread. So you can get fra the flatbread. Flatbread. Maybe with the salad. Yeah. Um, very yeah. nice. You can have the flatbread. You can enjoy it with the meatballs or eggplant rollatini, you know. Well, you're getting a lot of compliments on your wings yes. here, especially from Amanda. Best wings. We didn't see this salad, actually. This is the one that I really didn't go over. This has uh, apple strips, right? Apple, apple walnut. walnut. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Very, very nice, guys. You do such a lovely job. And uh, during the pandemic, I have to say, you stayed open, right, yeah. the whole time? It was a struggle, but here they are in Forest Avenue, 1298 Forest Avenue uh, in Port Richmond, and they have the best wings, and we're going to leave you with a beautiful uh, image of the wings. So I'm going to just pan around, and we're going to say goodbye to the pizza maker. Wave Bye. goodbye. So long. And the, the place that you had in Bay Terrace was Domenico's. Domenico's Pizza Bay, yes. That, that was what and it is. Also in Princess Bay, we had a Domenico's. Oh, neat. Yeah, so the, oh, Avenue. I remember that. Yeah. Excellent. So thank you, Anthony, for tuning in. Michael Pika. Hello, Michael. It's good to see you. Love Ungaro's, and I'm sure you love this pizza. This is a uh, prosciutto, and we've got a little truffle oil on there, arugula, and some mozzarella. Look at that crust. Michael Pika, check out that crust. Amazing. So take care, everybody. I just want to thank you so much for tuning in, and uh, it's good to see you. Good to see everybody. And uh, Kim, come say goodbye, and uh, say goodbye to all your fans here, because you've got a lot of them. Thank you. So and with that, it's good to see everybody. I'll see you next. Uh, Wednesday at 11.30 a.m. And uh, say, say goodbye to all your fans. Thank you. Thanks, Pam. Thank you very much. So 1298 Forest Avenue in Port Richmond. Bye now.